Your okay. fans asking a lot of questions. We did have a lot and lot of questions for this because you've got so many fans. Let's have a look at the first one. Okay. What's your biggest tip on catching the ball off a corner? You know, catching your head on it. Sweet in the sweet spot, you know? Catching your head on it. <laughs> Uh, that is from Taffy Shuffler. Good question, yeah. wasn't it? Um, what's my best tip? Best um, tip on heading the ball, I think he's trying to say. I guess keep your eyes open. Um, so, yeah. There you go. My eyes are closed right there. <laughs> just contradicts <laughs> But, yeah, I'm just saying, keep your eyes open. I didn't score that time, so keep your eyes open. That is one of your strengths, isn't it? You're, you're great in the air. You said yeah. that's one of your main assets? Yeah, yeah, very good in my, very good in my goal. I mean, very good. <laughs> very good in my head. Um, I managed to score quite a few goals in my head, yeah. so it's one of my better attributes. Good question, Taffy. Right, let's have a look at the next question. Yes, big man. My question for you is, although you play in League Two, you've got the hype of a Premier League player. Does it ever get in the way of your work with yourself and your teammates? Oh, good question from Craig. I like the fact he's got big up, big man in uh, Salute, graphics. Craig. Salute, uh, Craig. Good question. Does it, is it hard to balance the fact that you are um, a celebrity as well as your football career? I don't know about me being a celebrity. Um, no, it's, um, it's testing because it's a lot of hours. Um, but I'm a footballer first and foremost, so that always comes first. Um, but... I think I've got the balance. I've got the balance quite right. I've had a good okay. season this season, so it's a good balancing act. Good question, though. Okay, let's have a look good at the question. next one. If you could play under one Premier League manager, who would it be and why? Oh, and all the way from Australia, you fans. Say you're not a celebrity, that's all the way from Australia. Right. One Premier League manager, who would it be? Um, you know what? I see the, the way all the, the players kind of play for Conte today, but it'll have to be Klopp. I think Klopp's got that. Um, I'm a Liverpool supporter. It has to yeah. be Klopp. I think that he's got that enthusiasm. He's he's not a conventional manager. I just can't run as much like, as he wants. Do you, do you, do you like his personality as well? Yeah, his personality. Like. He just seems like he, he calls it as it is. Yeah. He's straight. He, you know what I'm saying? He seems fun, and the players look like they want to play for him. And yes. I think that's that's a good look. Okay, so have a look at one more question. Hi Adebayo, how often do you go to the gym, mate? Right, shakes first. Does he look like he needs to go in the gym for you? Um, yeah, his neck's kind of, he needs a little bit more neck in his... <laughs> okay. A little bit more. Now, in case you haven't noticed, you do go to the gym quite a bit, don't you? Uh, uh, yeah, a little bit. Let me see. Just a little bit. A little bit? Yeah, How little often bit. do you gym? Um, depends. If we ain't got a midweek game, four times five. If we've got a mid midweek game, three times. So, okay. between four and five times. But I'm slipping. I haven't been, I haven't been a little <laughs> He's while. He's slipping. So. Look at I'm that. I'm slipping. Wow. I'm now, slipping. You are being modest because your, uh, your gym work has led you to become officially, give it up for this, the strongest player in world football, according to FIFA. <laughs> this is your FIFA card, Bayo. Now, these all make up your physical attributes. Your physical attributes is 80, so within that, 98 strength. Oh! You, you might... <laughs> Look at his face, he's so proud of that. <laughs> What's it out of? Uh, uh, you, what is it out of? Yeah, exactly. You know it's out of, don't you? <laughs> you must be quite proud of that, though, on a serious note. No, no, real talk, real talk. Um, 99 is the highest. No, I'm, I, look, I don't know if you lot know, I'm in the Guinness Book of Records for being the most consistent, strongest player six years in a row. So <laughs> yeah. it's a blessing, I'm telling you. It's a blessing, so thank you. And you will lift anything, weights, benches, even Sky Sports news presenters. Yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah, Yo, yeah. go get me David Garrido. Garrido? Garrido. Who is David Garrido? What, you talking about that DG, bro? Right, DG's about that Sky Sports news presenting. Come here. Whoa, whoa! <laughs> so when we do that, and then we're like... Whoa, whoa. One. Oh, two. Good one, man. Sorry about that, team, man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we good? You remember that day well? What I love about that, not just your strength, but David Garrido's attire, the little, the little blue shorts. Yeah. <laughs> I remember that, that's DG. DG's my guy, shout out DG, man. DG, bro. Right, I think we have to... Bayo wouldn't be Bayo unless he attempted to lift something in this pub. Who wants to see Bayo lift something in the pub? Yeah! Come on, show me how it's done. All right. Right, three squats, yeah? All right, we're going to go three squats okay, with him, yeah? Here we go, count them in. So we go. Oh, one. Two. The depth is mad. I'll even hold. Oh, he's there. Three. <laughs> Guys, give it up for Eddie Bear. I can fend one. Love it. <laughs>